this video, we're going to show you how to transfer your domain to Namecheap. In general, transfer is the process of moving your domain from one registrar to another. You might do this if you do not wish to renew the domain with your current registrar, as transferring, in most cases, also simultaneously renews the domain for a year. Also, some registrars have specific features that you can only use if the domain is registered with them, so the ability to transfer a domain is quite essential. In most cases, the whole process is automated, so all you need to do is prepare the domain and submit the transfer. We'll also let you know whether you'll experience any downtime or not. So let's start. First, log into your Namecheap account. Next, click on the Domains drop-down menu in the toolbar at the top and proceed to the Domain Transfer tab. Then, enter the domain that you would like to transfer to us and click Transfer. You will see your current registrar, the domain's transfer lock status, and you'll be able to check auth code validity. A domain authorization code, or auth code, is unique to each domain name and is assigned by the registrar at the time of registration. It's required to transfer a domain from one registrar to another. To prepare the domain for the transfer process, you need to retrieve the auth code and have your domain unlocked. This needs to be done with your old registrar. We have guides on how to transfer from all the main registrars if you click here. If your current registrar is not in the list, you should try contacting their support team for help. If your domain is unlocked, but something is still preventing the transfer, you might want to check ICANN's official table of common who is statuses to determine what is causing the problem and how to fix it. We've put a link to ICANN in the video description. Also, it's essential to make sure the domain can be transferred without downtime on your website or email services. To ensure there isn't any downtime, you need to determine what name servers your domain is pointed to. The domain in this example is pointed to our shared hosting name servers, so we will not experience any downtime and services will not be affected. If your domain is pointed to hosting name servers, there will be no downtime at all. However, if your domain is using the basic name servers of your current registrar, there might be downtime as a result of the transfer. If this is the case, you can find information about how to minimize the amount of downtime in the description below this video. Additionally, if you look up your domain in any public who is, you will see the name servers your domain is pointed to. If the domain has an OK status, the domain transfer should go as intended. Let's proceed with the transfer. You'll see domain is unlocked in the registrar lock field once the process has been successful. Now, check the box next to domain contact information, stating that you agree for us to initiate who is verification after the transfer completes. If you do not have a domain with us yet, you'll need to fill in your contact details to proceed with the transfer. If you already have some domains with us and your details are verified, there is no need to do anything. Last but not least, enter the auth EPP code in the authorization code field and click Verify Auth Code. If the auth code is valid, you'll see the corresponding green check mark. After that, click on Add to Cart and then View Cart to proceed with the checkout process. Now you have successfully initiated the transfer of your domain to us. You can check the current status of your transfer directly in your account. To do this, hover your mouse over your Namecheap username in the top left corner. Click Profile, then click Domain List and choose the All Products view in the Domains drop-down menu. You should now see your domain there and can monitor the transfer status. The status should change to a waiting release from previous registrar. This can take between 15 and 30 minutes. Once you see the awaiting release from previous registrar status, it means that you did everything properly and the domain is now pending transfer to us. At this point, the registrar you are transferring from has five to seven days to complete the transfer. Since it's mostly an automated process, 
Now it's just a waiting game. When the transfer is completed, our system will inform you via email to your Namecheap primary email address. And that's it. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to post them under this video or check out our knowledge base at Namecheap.com for more tips and support.